What is going on, Chemical Guys family? We had an encounter with this person in a hazmat suit. He pulled up to the Chemical Guys store, dropped off his Prius, and this thing is filthy. Interior has seen better days. It looks like someone was chewing on this steering wheel. The, the brake pedal has gone through the floor mat into almost the frame. There's filth and grime everywhere. Toilet paper, a plant. So I'm actually bringing on visual on board so you can help me clean up the back seat while I'll be cleaning up the front seat. So don't mind us. Let's get right into this interior on this Prius V. First things first is we already went ahead and removed all the large items away from the interior of the car. Like this, it makes cleaning the car a lot easier. The dashboard, I don't even know what this is, but it, there's like a lot of like leaves sitting everywhere. So we're actually going to be dropping all the larger components, like the little twigs everywhere back onto the carpet because I'm still going to be uh, coming back and vacuuming out the carpet as well. Just get a clean microfiber towel and just start knocking everything down and you guys will start seeing that all of these larger items are going to get stuck onto the fibers. Now, uh, this is a great scenario. So I could show you guys that whenever you are cleaning uh, your interior, you're wiping down paint, microfiber towels, they act like little hands and they grab onto everything. So this is why you need to constantly just be flipping over to a different side. So I'll put these towels right here and I'm just going to dust off the dashboard. The owner of this car, I don't know where he's been at, but this car is a mess. So after wiping down the loose leaves and trash off the dashboard, we immediately started vacuuming the car. What we noticed was that there was a ton of dog hair, leaves, and trash throughout the whole entire car. What ends up happening is dog hair is going to trap itself into the fabric of the carpet, which means it's going to be a little bit more tedious to actually vacuum it out. All you need to do is just take your time, go side to side, so like this, you remove any dog hair, grime, or debris. But one thing we also did is we removed the floor mats so we can make sure we clean under the floor mats as well. So like this, we don't have to work twice. One pro tip for you guys is you always want to start from top to bottom. Start off by cleaning your dashboard, then work your way down to the carpet because what ends up happening is if you start cleaning out your carpet, all the grime and filth is going to land back onto the carpet if you start wiping down your dashboard after. So always start from top to bottom. So now that we got the larger components out of the way, now it's time to start wiping down the surface. So right here, I do have a little light layer of just like dust and I still want to remove it, but we still want to protect it. So I'll be getting my bottle of uh, Total Interior spray some directly onto my towel. Now, one of my favorite things about Total Interior, it virtually cleans all interior surfaces, whether it's dashboards, navigation screens, uh, plastic, vinyl, leather, the list goes on. This product is a one do it all product. It's going to clean and protect your interior. All right guys, so we just finished wiping down the whole entire surface using Total Interior. We cleaned it, we protected it. We even vacuumed out the interior of this Prius. Now we do have some dirtier parts on the car, such as like the seats, the door panels. So Alex behind me is actually using a horse hair detailing brush with Nonsense Super Cleaner. Whenever it comes to cleaning your door panels, dashboard, center consoles, or anything that is super filthy on your interior, we recommend using an all-purpose cleaner like Nonsense Super Cleaner. Whenever you're scrubbing down Nonsense Super Cleaner, we actually needed to pair it up using a horse hair detailing brush. This horse hair detailing brush was used in circular motions for one to activate the suds within Nonsense Super Cleaner. So like this, we have high amounts of lubricity on the surface and we won't be damaging it. All we're doing is just cleaning it. After we're done using Nonsense Super Cleaner, all you need to do is get a clean, soft microfiber towel to remove any spent product away from the surface. Before I forget, you could actually use Nonsense Super Cleaner on floor panels. This product works exceptionally well on plastics. Don't be afraid to use this product on leather or vinyl seats as well. And we are finally done with the Prius V's interior. The interior looks phenomenal. If I give you guys a full on tour of the interior, you guys can see the floor mats have been vacuumed, the seats have been vacuumed, and we only use two single products, which is Nonsense Super Cleaner and Total Interior to protect the plastics. Are you okay, Alex? He's okay. But anyways, guys, if you guys would like to pick up those products today, you can find them on our website right now, or stop by the logo Detour Garage. As always, I'm Henry, that's Alex, and we'll see you guys next time.